Hi and welcome to your cloud-based Puzzlebook compiler members area. My name is Ron Pumfleet. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to fill in the fields for the table of contents so that you can get your Puzzlebook uh, created. Let's log into my members area. We're on the home page so we need to click on table of contents. Obviously if you click here you'll be listening to me <laughs> or you're listening to me before you click on it. Anyway, enough of the side jokes. Click here. Now there's a little bit to do here. Um, these are all defaults. You can leave them exactly as they are or you can add uh, something to them. But all these fields must be uh, filled in. If you try leaving without filling them in then you'll actually have an error and it'll say please fill in um, that field. So uh, all I've done here is I'm, I'm a bit cheeky here. I've just taken a table of contents and filled that, copied that and put it in there and then I've title name for puzzles, page name, puzzle start, puzzle divider, solution start and the number of pages. So um, all is good there. So that's it. That's all you need to do to um, make sure that your table of contents page gets filled in correctly. So that's it. Thanks for watching and listening to me on how to fill in your table of contents. My name is Ron Pumphlet. I'm out of here. Catch you in the next video. Bye for now.